Hi, Reborn friends. It's Christina with the Reborn family. And today I am taking you with me behind the scenes on a little bit of a nursery tour. I'm here in my nursery this afternoon. And um, this is where I do a lot of my Instagram photos and a lot of the photos you'll see of the babies. I got a string there. I do that here. Um, I'm doing something totally different today in today's video. And I'm just gonna show you a couple of the babies I have that I have out today. Um, I'm just gonna kind of show you guys um, what it's like behind the scenes and just talk to you, um, kind of give you things from my point of view, quite literally. I'm just kind of vlogging this from my, my point of view here, of what, what the babies and the nursery and everything looks like um, from where I'm at. So we've got little Lucy here. Um, for those that don't know, um, Lucy is up for adoption, unfortunately. Um, she's looking for a mama potentially right now. So if you are interested in that, I will put um, her listing information in the description below. Uh, we've got Luca here, Corbett Luca, little baby Luca. He was in our live with us the other day. Um, I love this boy. I'm gonna be doing an outfit change on him in just a minute. Of course, we've got Benny. Benny is always a favorite. Um, notice I layer a lot of times I'll layer the reborns I'll have a onesie under their clothes sometimes just because when you have a real newborn a lot of times you'll layer them just so cute and then of course we can't forget Maverick Maverick is a little bit on his own over to the side because you don't want silicone and vinyl to touch Maverick is a full body silicone and the rest of the babies are vinyl of course so I'm gonna grab Luca and bring him over to the changing table and we're gonna do an outfit change oh one more thing um You'll notice that the babies with rooted hair, which I have all rooted hair babies out today, they, um, I always keep plastic behind their head and that is to protect their rooting hair. So uh, you just wanna be extra careful if you have a rooted hair baby and, um, and keep plastic behind their head. All right, let's get Luca and change him. All right, so Luca is on the changing table. He is ready to change. The nursery is a bit of a mess. I probably should have cleaned it up before I, I did a nursery tour, but I've got blankets there in that basket. Um, I've got a ton of clothes here and accessories and all of that. So, and then this is the changing table. I've got this lovely basket. Uh, my mother-in-law got me this as a Christmas gift, actually. Um, it is a changing basket made by Design Dua. So I love this basket. I think it's just so sweet. All right, let's 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 see if we can get him changed. So I have never done a video this style before where it's like one-handed, <laughs> I'm kind of talking and, um, you know, holding the camera and, and all of that. I've seen other Reborn channels do this before. So I wanted to give it a try, but I'm not really sure how well it's gonna go. Might have to set the camera up for a minute while I, while I change him. Um, so yeah, so here's what's going on in today's video, you guys. So so you can decide if you were if you're gonna stay with me or not. And I promise I'll do something special at the end. So wait till the end. But um, I am just experimenting with videos. I'm doing all different types of videos and styles and um, and all of that uh, with my reborns, with my family, with my reborn family, um, and just kind of seeing what you guys like. So let me know in the comments if there's anything you guys want to see, what you like, what you don't like. Um, if you want to see more of me, less of me, I've been kind of getting out of the videos a little bit more, um, you know, so you see less of my face and more of the beautiful, beautiful babies instead. So I don't know what you guys prefer. Just let me know in the comments. If there's anything you want to see, you want to ask us, we're pretty much an open book. We're open to suggestions um, and we'll answer as many questions as we can. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to have to... Uh, to set the camera up. All right, hold on guys, I'll be right back. Okay, still not the best view probably, but I'll try. All right, so we're gonna get Luca changed. Right now he is wearing a onesie from Jamie K. And I love, love Jamie K. Um, if you've followed my channel for a while, you know that I really like Kate Quinn. I'm starting to get a little bit away from Kate Quinn and finding different um, brands that I like, different baby clothes and things like that. And I really like, Jamie K, but Jamie K is hard to find boy clothes. Um, so they, or when she does have boy clothes, they sell out rather quickly. Um, what little they do in newborn size anyway. 
you can probably find the bigger sizes but so today Luca is gonna wear this sweet little outfit um, this is from his artist it came with him in his box opening so we're gonna put this cute little outfit on him I'm trying to be careful with his hair I'm not very good when it comes to changing the babies as far as like I don't know <laughs> I try to be careful but um, so I try, I, I've used to change my, my reborns as often as I could, almost daily if I could. Um, and then I would take photos of them every morning and post it on Instagram. Um, but one, I don't really have the time. As the girls are getting older, they're a little bit more demanding. Uh, and two, um, I just want to be more careful with the reborns. And I feel like if I change them too often, that's not good for them. So especially with the higher end ones. Luca is a very high-end one. In fact, he's probably the most expensive reborn that we have in our collection right now. Also, I do wanted to show his diaper. So he came with this diaper, and in the U.S., we don't have diapers like this. We do. We have pull-ups, is what they're called, um, like this in the U.S., but they are, um, this is a newborn diaper on him, maybe a little bit bigger. It might be a size one diaper. Um, so for like, you know, zero to three months, essentially. It says size small on there. And, um, Anyway, he came from Bellaru, and so um, that's where his diaper is from, obviously, and I just thought it was really cool because we don't have diapers like this in America. So I'm keeping that diaper on him for now. I've never changed his diaper. I don't um, typically change their diaper, um, except for every once in a while, just to kind of freshen it up so it looks like a fresh diaper. Otherwise, I don't change it. I like the two snaps better than the the three, four, five, six snaps, whatever it is, they're all, they vary, but usually it's three snaps. I like the two snaps. I think it looks better on the reborns. If it was a real baby, it would be easier with two snaps instead of, you know, more, but yeah, so I like the two snaps. Oh, he's so cute, you guys. I don't know, he looks so cute in a onesie. I don't know if he needs the pants, but we'll put the pants with it because the, the outfit came with the pants. It's so cute. So let me know in the comments, guys, what have you been up to? Um, introduce yourselves. I am just, just getting to know um, all of you guys, and I love getting to know you guys. I love getting to hear about your reborns, about the new additions you have coming to your collection, um, about you know if you like silicone, if you like vinyl, all that. I just love getting to know you guys. So let me know in the comments. Um, any, any fun fact about you and or your Reborn collection? I would love to hear it. Um, I love getting to know you guys. If you missed the live, I did just do a live on Friday evening. And um, during that live, I was talking about how awesome our supporters have been. I just really, the kind um, messages, the kind emails and um, I get on, on a, or direct messages I get on Instagram and all the comments, all the kind comments we get here on YouTube. I just really appreciate all the support and, and love it so much. So as you can see, Luca is a really big boy. So newborn, this is um, this is either newborn size or zero to three month size. And even that is a little small on him. He's definitely, he's a big boy. He would fit in three months. But sorry, the camera's shaking here as I change it. But look at how cute he looks. Got his binky here. This is his binky from from his artist. Look at him. How sweet is he? So sweet. Look at that boy. Little Luca. He's so tired. Look at him. his arm is even laying, laying over my arm because he's just so sleepy. You know, we've had one video officially come out about uh, the Reborn family through the Truly Network. Um, I know a lot of people saw that. I know we got a lot of new subscribers from that and um which is awesome um but uh things have kind of slowed down so there were a lot of questions at one point that people were asking us and i don't remember all the questions and so um if you guys have any questions about the truly um i'm just gonna rock with luca here about the truly episode or anything like that you know you guys can feel free to ask me i may or may not answer <laughs> uh and then um we do have a TV show, a TV network uh, based in Europe that came out here to Texas and filmed a special on the Reborn family. That's going to be airing soon in the next couple weeks, I believe. Um, it's not going to be airing in the U.S., but it will probably be online for the U.S. to see, so you can see it online, um, but it will be on television um, throughout Europe. 
Uh, they are based out of specifically Germany. So um, hopefully, you know, that will uh, bring some new new people to our channel as well. And hopefully it'll be all good things. I don't know what the episode is going to look like yet, but but hopefully I'll, I'll get a preview of it soon and I'll share it with all of you guys uh, when it does come out. I'll let you know where you can view it. Um, so yeah, so this is it. This is kind of what I do um, when I have any quiet time to myself, which isn't very often, but um, the girls are, um, well, Joy is not feeling well today, so she's laying down and Grace is um, at our neighbor's house. We have a, a neighbor who is just so sweet. We call her Miss Sarah and um, the girls adore her and she adores the girls. And so um, they visit her um, maybe once every two or three weeks. They go over to her house for a couple hours just to play and, and spend time with her. So that's where Gracie is today. Uh, so I had some quiet time while Joy was laying down and I thought I would just kind of hop on here and make a quick video and share the Reborns with you guys. So. So this is what I do. I just kind of will change them. I'll, I'll maybe give them some cuddles and hold them. A lot of times I'll take photos of them like I showed you um, in the basket where I set up a lot of my Instagram photos. Um, and that's kind of it. Pretty quiet, pretty pretty chill. Um, nothing too crazy. Um, it does get crazy, of course, when we take them on outings as you guys have gone along with us on those outings. Um, those are a lot of fun. We are gonna be doing an outing very soon we're going to do a reborn family outing uh, we have gracie's fifth birthday party coming up so we probably won't be able to do it until after her birthday party in a few weeks but i promise soon we're going to do a reborn family outing we're really excited about it i think it's going to be really fun um i know you guys enjoy watching us do the outings and we get we typically get a lot of reactions to the reborns so um i'm thinking luca is who i'm gonna take on our next outing but i don't know you guys feel free to let me know in the comments who you think we should take on our next outing. Should it be Luca? Um, we've already done an outing with Benny. I kind of did an outing with Maverick, um, our full body silicone. I'd like to do another outing with Maverick though because um, I did it without my husband so I was filming it myself so it wasn't quite the same. Um, it's a lot easier when I have someone filming so that I can hold the babies. Uh, I wasn't able to hold Maverick when I did the outing with him because I was filming. So anyway, um, it's probably going to be between Maverick or Luca, but I don't know. I've got um, I've got a couple to choose from, so we'll see. Let me know in the comments if there's a baby you would like to see us do an outing with. Um, I try to do, to not, ideally I like to only do one outing with the Reborn. Sometimes I'll do two or three, but I try not to do like a ton with the same baby just because, I don't know, I think it's more fun to kind of get a variety of different babies on outings, but maybe I'll do the same baby, I don't know. Um... Yeah, so I'd love to hear what you guys think about that. And so as I was saying, there was a lot of questions about the Truly episode that came out about us. Um, and there's a lot of questions uh, that will probably come out when the um, TV network does the airs the episode about us. I don't know how it'll go. I think it'll go well. They were really nice and I think they'll they'll do a good job. So maybe not too many questions, at least not too many crazy questions, but maybe you guys will have questions about that. So um, I'm more than happy to answer uh, any questions you guys may have, but as I've mentioned in the past, there have been a lot of kind of haters and people that have, people seem to love to gossip about me or, or uh, spread misinformation about, about me or my family. So, um, you know, that makes it tough on me. Um, sometimes I have to just get off social media, shut my phone off and just take a break because um, they make it hard on all of us. So. Um, I tried my best to ignore them, but just keep the positivity. Um, I kind of decided that this is my channel and I'm just going to keep it positive. So if you have any really like offensive questions, I more than likely will not answer it because I just won't give negativity the time of day anymore. But, you know, I guess it depends on the question. I'm not easily offended, but um, I've been surprised uh, since the Truly episode came out at, at the things people have said. So you never know. Anyway, guys, that's all I really have for today. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for hanging out with Luca and helping me change his outfit. He looks so cute. And um, yeah, I will see you guys again very soon. I'm gonna be doing a live again this week. So stay tuned for that. Look on our community page here on YouTube for updates on when I'm gonna be doing uh, the next live. So you can join us in the chat, ask any question you'd like, and I may or may not answer. <laughs> um, I'm also going to be doing an Instagram live as well this week. So look for that too. I will update you guys here on the community page as well as on our Instagram page. If you don't follow us already, I'll put all the links down below in the description of this video. 
And finally, thank you so much for being here. We love you guys. You're important to us. Bye, Reborn Friends. Oh, I did promise that I would add something special at the end. So I wanted to share with you guys a couple things. So Gracie, as I mentioned, she has a birthday coming up. These are some of her birthday party decorations. Can you guess what theme she chose for her fifth birthday? <laughs> So, yep, I've got the some of the, her birthday party decorations. And then I wanted to share with you guys this, this old gal. This is an original Samantha from American Girls. This was my doll when I was about seven, eight years old. Um, and I still have her. My mom saved her for me. Oh, and next to her, you'll see Gracie painted this for me for my nursery because it's rainbow. So I thought that was sweet. Um, anyway, yeah, so this is Samantha, and I have had her since I was a little girl, and so she's a little beat up. Um, I used to take her everywhere and play with her all the time, but uh, yeah, so very special, kind of a childhood memory for me. Someday I'll probably give her to the to the girls. Um, maybe when I have grandchildren, I'll give them to my give her to my grandchildren or something. I don't know. I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with her yet, but for now she's just hanging out in the reborn nursery. So say hi to Samantha. Have you guys ever had like a, a special doll that uh, maybe you have still in your life as an adult? Let me know in the comments. All right, bye guys.